you guys want to try being a tech reviewer? Well, 20 of our lucky viewers will get the chance to borrow and test out the Oppo F11 Pro. So, we are driving... Going to Oppo HQ. Yeah, to pick up the F11 Pros for our 20... 20 lucky winners. It kind of feels like we're in a heist right now. It's like we're going there empty-handed. When we leave, we're gonna have 20 phones with us. <laughs> oh no! If we get robbed though, that would be something. <laughs> Don't jinx it. <laughs> we're not getting robbed. Okay. Not on my watch. Boy. We'll see you guys in Oppo. What's up, Joey? What's so, up? update, update. We just parked the car. Uh, we're in BGC, as you can see, we're walking to Oppo's office to get them phones. Get them phones! Oh no! Oh, you have to. Okay. So now we're gonna get those phones, those 20 F11 Pros. Bye. So, oh, my arms are <laughs> we're back in the car. We're headed to the office. Joey's here. We got the phones up back right there. The 20 F11 Pros in. It's 10 Aurora Green units and 10 Thunder Black units, which is the one we reviewed in our uh, video. Okay, and then we'll be finalizing our 20 chosen viewers who get the phone for two weeks. Yeah, we've messaged some already. So, yeah. What's the Hunger <laughs> Game? The May the. May the Force be with you? No! <laughs> <laughs> may, may the. May the... May, may the live long and prosper. No! <laughs> may the fates be ever in your favor, I think. Woo! May the force ever be in your favor, be with you, and prosper. <laughs> <laughs> okay, see you guys in the office. Boom! We're back in the office. Here is Vaughn, and there is Mr. Joey, contacting all of you as we are... Show my Facebook. Uh, A few inches later. So it's been 11 days. The challenge is over. Our 20 participants have already taken their time reviewing the Oppo F11 Pro. And here's what they had to say. Take it away, guys. Hi, guys. Issei here. So for today's video, I will be talking about my final opinion on Oppo's latest phone, which is the Oppo F11 Pro. So, the opinion of the F11 Pro is guys, I una. The phone itself is pretty good. The phone itself holds itself pretty well. I really love the thunder black color because it reminisces the color that we found on the Oppo Find X. And it has a very comfortable grip, a very sleek, very classy. The F11 Pro's panoramic display gives less obtrusion given its thin bezels and the absence of a notch. The colors are good, the viewing angles are great. Laki ang liwanag, linaw, enjoy lang. After using it, I've been playing a lot of games, and so far, I'm having no trouble. The graphics are awesome, and my overall gaming experience is pretty much a par with that shit I also love how fast Vogue charging is in filling up the juice of F11 Pro's huge battery. It's so charge, guys. So One hour. One hour lang. Full charge na agad yung phone. And sobrang tagal yung malubat. Well, first off, uh, sabi ka sa Oppo F11 Pro, ang ganda ng camera. The superb dual cameras at the back and the amazing pop-up selfie cam actually kept up with my daily photography needs. And you can see how clear it is doing a selfie video. <laughs> Na 
Now without further ado, the Oppo F11 Pro gets a thumbs up for me. It's a great performer across the board. Overall, the Oppo F11 Pro is a great phone. My experience so far has been nothing but amazing. The final thoughts are, I get it's a great buy. Also, the specifications are amazing for the price. I get to game a lot because of the battery. Also, the six and a half inch screen. And for its price, this new device from Oppo really did a great job on placing itself as one of the best phones in mid-range category. Pala kanino nga ba talagang F11 Pro? For the selfie lovers, yan. Uh, for those na gusto ng extras, like gusto nyo talaga ng full screen display and you want to avoid the notch, it's a very good deal for that price. Lalo na syempre yung mechanical camera. With features and design that surely packs a punch, it gives the other devices in the mid-range spectrum a run for their money. The F11 Pro is a beast at its price, delivering you good price to performance ratio. Surely, something that I would coin as a bang for your buck. For a mid-range phone at 18,990, worth it talaga siya. Given a chance that makakabili ako ng mga I would keep this in mind. If you're looking for an upgrade or even switch from Apple or if you're looking for a phone that does everything, check this phone out. The 18,990 press card is a game changer in the range market. I love the phone and many will surely feel the same way if they get to experience the Oppo F11 Pro. Although expensive, I think it is justifiable with the quality of hardware and software it has. Starting from the Oppo F11 Pro as I've seen this sort of power value, quality, and at the same time, performance that I've never seen before in, well, a mid-range smartphone. I find it really amazing as a person who likes to document things. I must say that I couldn't find anything wrong with the F11 Pro. Rather, I find the F11 Pro as a bang for the buck phone, especially with its specs. Well, guys, ang ibibigay yung own points dito sa Oppo F11 Pro na to is... Fair pack. 100 points Dahil guys, gusto ng gusto ko talaga itong Oppo F11 Pro na to at yung kanyang mga specs Nice one talaga Oppo Alright, well said So, you know, doing a video like this with you guys, our viewers Like a community review of a particular product It's actually been kind of fun making this Yep so, yeah. I actually do want to do more of this in the future and if you guys feel the same let us know in the comment section below and if you enjoyed this video please do drop a like subscribe to our channel for more content hit that bell icon so you get notified of future uploads and be sure to visit yukitech.com for the latest tech news and reviews this has been joey and miguel and we'll see you in the next one